big warning for Valley dog owners this morning. You'll want to listen to this. Yeah, we're seeing a spike now in a potentially deadly bacteria. It's easy to catch mm -hmm. too for your dog. Uh, Justin Pizzera joining us now live from Scottsdale. Justin, what's this all about? Yeah, you know, Dan, you were talking about how easy it is to catch. That's the really scary thing right here. So say a sick dog is walking along and it urinates right over here and your dog comes up right behind it. It's possible your dog could catch this. And the really scary part, even you could catch this bug. So we're talking about leptospirosis. Uh, normally the Valley only sees about four cases every year. Right now we are sitting at about 40 cases. So a lot more cases uh, making its way around the Valley. There are no human cases uh, at this point, but this bacteria, it can live for months in wet soil. That's one of the reasons why we really don't see it here in Arizona because it is so dry. So right now, health officials, they're really trying to figure out why it's popping up so much right now in the valley. We talked with one valley vet who does have a theory. There's a possibility that an infected animal from somewhere else was inadvertently brought in to the Phoenix area. The owners probably didn't know and may have gone to a doggy daycare center or to a dog park and have um, spread it, you know, not purposely, inadvertently. Okay, so here are the symptoms that you need to watch for. Your dog is probably gonna be tired, probably isn't gonna be eating a lot, but the dog will drink a lot of water and probably be urinating a lot. So this disease, here's the good thing, it can be treated with an antibiotic. You just gotta catch it early. So coming up at six, we're gonna be talking about uh, the hardest hit cities. We're digging into that coming up in about 30 minutes. All right, Justin, we're talking about dogs. Let's kind of shift the conversation